Let me show you another example of why we might use ascend. Sometimes we want to thicken a vocal using something called chorus. We can go ahead and add a chorus effect directly to my vocal as an insert. But let's say I want to set up a chorus track that I can send other tracks to. And I want to mix dry signal with the wet signal. So I want to use ascend for this. So I'll go ahead next to my reverb. I'll do shift command N. Command right click for stereo, command down click for aux. And we'll call this chorus. Let's go ahead and insert a chorus plugin. We'll choose one of the new plugins from Pro Tools Air Chorus. And we'll just do something like a soft stereo. And now we'll create a bus for the chorus. This is where I will route the vocal to. We'll choose bus seven, eight. And let's rename that just so we're clear. We'll say to chorus. Okay, I need to create a new send from my vocal. I still have my reverb send. I can create a new one by command clicking here, going to assignments. In my next slot, which is not gonna be affected by my reverb slot, I will choose to chorus. I can choose it here. I can command click here. And either way I can set the fader. Let's turn on the chorus. I'll turn off the reverb for the moment. And let's see what this sounds like. I believe in new beginnings. So you can see how it thickens the vocal. You, you make my life worth living. And maybe I want to send that same chorus to my four harmonies. Let's solo them. And I will shift command. First I'll select them. Then I'll shift option and choose the same send and I'll raise each one up a little bit and we'll listen. I believe in new beginnings. I can even pan them. And you you make my life worth living. We'll this is without the chorus, I'll mute that. These wheels from this is with the chorus. Somewhat out of control, but Let hey, let's add go. The group bus Without the chorus, in new and with the chorus, and you, you make my life worth living. So there are a couple examples of how we would use ascend in a mix.